next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. Here she is, big time feel, no surprise there. The UFC Hall of Famer and former women's bantamweight champion, the great Rowdy Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey is a box office hit. Every time her name sits atop the marquee, the stars come out. Yes. From her UFC debut with the quick submissions to Jean LaBelle standing next to the octagon with the timer. Everything was always a spectacle, and Ronda had the skills to back it up. I remember being at weddings and bar mitzvahs back in 2011, getting texts from guys like Sean Shelby. Dude, you gotta see what Ronda Rousey just did, and it didn't take her long to enter the mainstream, successfully defended the title several times. Ronda Rousey, back and perhaps with a point to prove here tonight. All right, so here she is, one of the more prolific kickboxers to cross into the UFC in some time. She might kick harder than you, bro. Oh, yeah, she does kick so hard. I mean, you look at the videos. The videos are all out there. And you watch this young lady landing these brutal leg kicks on the bag, landing the high kicks, the body kicks. It's, it's unreal to watch someone of this stature able to land and be as physical as she is. She's so aggressive in her approach. She's so comfortable in such tight confines that her opponents usually panic because they can't understand, as we can, how she can be okay when she's under duress as she is. I asked her to kick me in the leg at our fighter meeting on Thursday, and as you see, I'm still limping. So she packs some power, and her opponent better be ready for it here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's what is the first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, two losses. She stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the former UFC women's bantamweight champion of the world, Rowdy Ronda. And now with the her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 131 pounds. Fighting out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, the chosen one. All right, nothing to lose in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come back to your corners, come out front. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? You ready? We are ready to go with round one here. Well, that left hand has been there for her tonight, not on that attempt. If your opponent has you in the clinch, pulling down on your head, landing punch after punch, you have got to clear that collar tie, reach back inside, and try to find space. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, she landed a big knee to the body. Now she's got the more time. Down the tip lane. Oh, 
All right, half guard position for her here, and this is a spot where we've seen her have a lot of wild success in previous fights. She has a tremendous amount of success in this position because she's so knowledgeable. She keeps the right side underhook, and she just goes to work with that left arm. She's got one of the best arm bars in the business going for it now. Gotta be careful, arm bar. Oh, we're getting a finish here. And this might just be a matter of time. grappling right there, and nice finishing instincts as well. You see a lot of fighters get the dominant position, but aren't necessarily able to lock up the choke or force the tap. No problem with her as she gets one of the bigger wins of her UFC career. So there she is, your winner by way of submission. That's a finish they'll be talking about for some time. We go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, three seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out, Brody! this young woman as the celebration is on. She sat down in our fighter meeting and she told us to a man, to a woman, I'm gonna submit her at some point in this fight and that's exactly how she